Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening. Again, this is Ed Womack, the Life Transformer, back with Words on Wednesday. And today, we're going to chat about the little things. You see, what are you struggling with today? Is it possibly moving into a new arena? Is it possibly starting a business? Is it possibly trying to figure out new ways to deal with your employment? I don't know. But what I do know is this. Chances are, it's the little things that are going to make the greatest impact. You see, I'm reminded of a situation where nine years and a few months ago, I was at the wit's end. I was sick and tired of being sick and tired. I had been struggling with drug addiction, and it was time for me to get some help. And what I decided to do was I went to this facility called Trinity House Big Bethel, which was a program for homeless men who were struggling with substance abuse. And when I arrived at Trinity House, I was told that they were at capacity. But the intake coordinator, to whom which I am immensely grateful, eternally grateful to this day, Mrs. Shira Walker, she came down to get me for my intake interview, and I just merely stood up and shook her hand. And at that very moment, she was about to tell me they were at capacity. But simply because I stood up and shook her hand, she said, you know what? I see something special in you. Are you in a situation where if you were to just take that little bit of extra effort, if you were just to take that first step, if you were to step outside of your comfort zone and seek the help you needed, would something tremendous happen in your life? You see, here today, I stand before you, the life transformer, but just nine years ago, I was broke, busted, and disgusted, strung out on crack cocaine, and just because that one grateful day that I simply stood up and reached out to shake the hand of the intake coordinator, Mrs. Shira Walker, she afforded me the opportunity of a lifetime, the opportunity to be restored. Now, I know some of you sitting out there, substance abuse may not be your story, but whatever your journey entails. It's the little things that mean so much. It's like they used to say with Hallmark. It's the little things that mean so much. The grandiose results don't happen by just merely snapping one's fingers or clicking your heels like Dorothy. It's the little things that mean so much. And as always, good, better, best. We can't let it rest until our good is our better and our better is our best. And this is Ed Womack, the Life Transformer with Words on Wednesday. And we'll see you at the top now because the bottom's entirely too crowded. And I want you to remember this. It's the little things that mean so much.